So I'm not sure if this is the clove hitch, but it's similar to it. I figured it out when I was trying to teach myself. It's a knot to use to tie around tree branches to lower down to the ground. So similar to the clove hitch, you cross over your main rope. We'll start again. We'll go around the branch, let's say. Okay. Cross over. Okay, so cross over. So it makes an X. Cross over again. Okay, now you can see the X right here. Okay, then when you come around, you lift up the X. Okay. And the, the one in the middle. And you just go underneath both of them. I know it looks a little confusing, but... Now when you pull, you can see the X, and this is the one that, we pull it just gets tight, there's no way it's coming undone. You could do your safety half hitch or double half hitch if you have a long enough tail, but this alone by itself is super, super tight, and you just push this up to break it, it comes right out. Let's show you that again. So you go over, and whichever way you go, left or right, it doesn't matter from the center, you Let's go to the left first. Okay, then to the right. Okay, you see your X. And when you come over, you lift up all, th all three of them. Lift up all three and go right underneath all three. Come out in the middle. And when you pull, it tightens on itself. And it does not come out no matter how much moving and jerking you do. Rolling, turning, spinning. It just keeps getting tighter. And you could do a half hitch for backup safety. You know, it's just, there's no way this is coming out. So I just learned that. I don't know if that is the clove hitch, but there it is.